Hello everyone, Blue here. It's totally not April Fool's Day and uh, that means I totally am quitting all of my previous things I've done so far. Meaning I will transition over Minecraft since again it's not April Fool's Day. And haha, will you look at that funny? It says what's up dog when I started this game. That's quite a funny, isn't it? Well then, let's actually start playing now. No? Oh. Okay. I'm gonna name this world our own survival world. Just our world. And the seed will be... No, I can't. Let's just do it. This community is so epic. I think that should be a nice thing to say, right? Alright. Let's... Let's just get done and generate this world. I hope we have a lot of fun in this one. It's Minecraft, of course we're gonna have fun. We're gonna b build lots of houses, we're gonna build pretty much everything that's ever been. Maybe even a statue in honor of Hotland Mammy. Since I have totally quit it and it's totally not dead right now. So how has your day been everyone? Mine has been quite well, thank you for asking me. Damn, you, your day has been that rough? Uh, I'm sorry. Hey, at least a bad day is followed by a good day, right? Bad luck get, get, gets balanced out with good luck, right? That's what I always believe. At least I hope that's how it works. So we're now in our first Minecraft world and... It looks quite pretty. I need to change my settings, hold on. Get get out of here. No. Sure, let's let's just do everything fancy, okay? The fuff, please turn it up. Wake pro sure. Look at oh hello and the man. I will not bother you. Look at this beautiful world, it's all ours. We can build in it, we can mine, we can Explore everything. You know what the sad part is? This is actually making me a bit nostalgic for no reason. I... I actually feel quite nostalgic playing Minecraft again. I mean, sure, I started playing Minecraft like a month or two again, a month or two ago again, but just this on my own and with the music in the background... Yeah, it kinda hit me deep in the feelings. You know, lives could, life could be going better for me. Sometimes I wish I had this, sometimes I wish I had that. Life is not a wish concert, and I truly know that. But sometimes I just wish I actually was someone else. Do you know that feeling? Having issues with self-confidence? It's... it sucks, yeah, but... The only thing you can really do, or this case I, is to just stay strong through it and fix your faults. But what if you're lazy and that is exactly your fault? Well, you just have to fix that fault then and get either help by friends or be motivated enough to help yourself. Of course that isn't quite easy and you always procrastinate things. Let me tell you about some things. I've got my final exams in two, not even three months coming, and it's gonna be painful, I tell you. We wrote a big math exam today, which was similar to a final exam, and everyone in our class said it was bad. Even the best in math said it was bad. Now, if if you hear that from the dude, from a dude like that, you know, how am I gonna survive the final math exam? That's where this law panic kicks in for me. Of course I'm gonna worry if I'm actually gonna be able to do it. Of course I'm gonna worry if I even have a chance of beating this math exam. But I've gotta stay strong for it again. I... I just have to. I'm even planning on going to a... For, of a school after this high school, or I don't know what school, how you call this in English, I'm quite sorry. 
and to be honest I'm both sure and unsure. I could either just get a job directly, which I still do not want, or I could just continue with school. It's not lives that I wish concert, which I mentioned earlier. Hold on, be right back. I need to do something shortly. Okay, I am back. Sorry for the short absence of mine. You know that feeling of you wanted to go back to the good old times where you thought everything was better? It... I'm currently experiencing that right now. I'm talking about the 2016 or even 2015 times. Back then I didn't have to worry much. Not even... Yeah, not even in 2017. 2016-17 was, uh, even 15, was such a special experience for me. That's the first time where I actually started developing my personality a bit more. And I'm talking about you exactly. I made those things you call called videos on this YouTube channel, and if you scroll back far, far enough, you can see that I made some FNAF B videos. Even if they have bad quality, if they are related to FNAF. I'm still proud of them somehow. I, I'm i really just proud. It's something I made when I was younger. It was something I did in my free time. It was just something I'm proud of. And I really enjoy that thought. I really enjoy the thought that no one can really bring down my happiness and proudness about my own content. It's, <laughs> it's quite a beautiful thought. I'm just gonna build this house, and then probably go mine. Should be a good idea. Is it getting dark? Where's the... Oh, middle of the day already. We even have sheep here, that's quite nice. Hold on, let me just check something up. What about the music? You know, music is very important right now. I guess I'll have to wait until... I know I'm not the best Minecraft house builder, but... This is the best I can do for now, while talking like this. Sometimes wish you would have done things differently in your life, like certain points in your life that you could have just went at a different path altogether. For a strange reason, I have that almost every day. It's just, of course, there's no use bothering about the past. The past, the past, you can't change it. But I always wonder, what would have happened if I did this? What would have happened if I did that? Would have things really been different? Would I have been a different person? Of course, you can't really let yourself get bothered by these thoughts and instead think, hey, why, why bother? I'm currently the person I am right now and I like myself like that. So why bother about other possibilities? When I already am happy with my. Of course, it contradicts with my self confidence issues from earlier, which is perfectly fine. Just have to combat that somehow, in any way possible, and it helps me focus quite a lot sometimes. Now, what surprises me? Sometimes, when you don't even sleep, you, <laughs> you tend to perform quite well in tests or something like that. It's strange, it probably shouldn't happen like that, but it still happens to me, and it happened to me today. And if I had not done that, I I would have surely failed my affix uh, that I had today. I just wish I could go back to the 2016 times. That's why I actually interacted a lot and did a lot of YouTube. You see, I, I've i kind of grown up with you. My bigger sister, older sister, I guess, showed me YouTube when I was way younger and was like... And, <laughs> no jokes, I actually used to watch Family Guy Funny Moments. Of course, I was younger and I did watch them. I basically grew up once more with 
watched all. Of course, not illegal things, but instead wholesome things like Minecraft. Not as wholesome rage Call of Duty troll videos. In 2016, I just started doing commentary with this person named Ash101. Some of you still might remember him. I have some regrets, but they are overshadowed by what actually happened. How much experience and fun I've had doing all. You can you can't really turn those memories into bad memories for me. It's just something that exists in the back of my mind. It's just something I appreciate that I did. I learned quite a bit through. To be honest, I learned quite a lot through YouTube. I may not be the most social person, in fact I'm quite the opposite, but hey, at least I've got some peeps on the internet who probably care about me, I've got some people on there that I can talk with. But sometimes you just have that feeling, am I a bother to everyone? Am I just useless? Do I not matter? Will they even care if I just disappear one day? And that's what, um, that's quite a hard thought again. It's... I don't know. I don't know how to describe myself. It's hard. I rarely hear anything about myself, which I'm totally fine with and understandable. And I'd rather make people be happy about themselves. I really like the thought of making other people happy instead of myself. That's why I even do YouTube. I don't really care about myself, which is bad, of course, but thinking about other people is just making them happy, trying to make them happy, having them at least chuckle once, that's way better than doing something or achieving a personal achievement. <laughs> Let me just make some slowly start descending it's quite strange how no minecraft music is hold on let me fix that it's kind of boring my pc will probably lag but it's okay i hope it can handle it because a minecraft let's play after all i do not know how long i'm gonna do this i'm probably gonna make 80 parts <laughs> add milk all of it but huh, it should be a shame if this was a joke video and I wouldn't actually continue this right but I like I'm currently in the hold on I need to re I'm currently in this phase what a nice house well, I'm smiling I'm currently in this phase phase where Everything just doesn't make sense to me. E everything I think about slowly just doesn't make sense for me anymore. I guess that's what growing up kind of is. Realizing some things don't even make sense when you think about them hard enough. And all of that other shenanigans. I should have made a pickaxe. <laughs> let's see, what else is there to talk about? So let's talk about you guys. I hope you've had quite a nice evening or something, or even a day. You know, if you sometimes feel down, I, I'm not the best motivational speaker or happy maker, I know that, but sometimes if you just have a down day and you just gotta ignore the negative parts if you can ignore them and just focus on the tiny positive actions that you've done or someone else has did to you on that day. And it honestly helps me kind of with my negative mentality. I mean, judging by my age, I, of course, am doubting a lot, even myself a lot. So just trying to stay positive, trying to think about the positive things, and trying to either ignore the negative thoughts, which is not good, or try to iron them out, aka better them, that's a good thing. It's... Sometimes I wish life wasn't really this... Pr Okay, I may sound stupid and super duper smart, which I am not, trust me. 
At least I think mys I myself think that I'm not smart. Why is why is life sometimes complicated? I don't get it. I I just want to still keep making videos and having fun with it. But of course, li life's really slowly fucking approaching me with that Glock behind my back. And I've got to make choices now. Do I want to make those choices? No. Do I have to? Yeah, of course. That's a sad part of growing up, I guess. Am I happy for some choices? Of course I am, yes. There are some choices I actually am excited about. And then there are some choices which... Yeah, you could debate heavily. We shouldn't focus on this, on all of this real talk. We should focus on mine. Oh yeah, I want to play music. Oh god. Uh, hold on. Some music. Oh, there it is. Yep. Oh, you know, this music gives me a lot of nostalgia. This is probably the first piece of music everyone's, everyone has heard back in the day. And that's just... It, it does give up a nostalgic vibe, yeah. You know, you remember when Micro was really simple, like in a beta? In 1.7.3 beta at least? I think I started with 1.6 alpha, which wasn't too bad, but I, my cousin, my older cousin introduced me to it, and I got, I got addicted to it. It was a lot of fun. I, I could build whatever I want. I could play with friends. For the first month or two, I played with my cousin and his friends on his private Minecraft server. They had built this really huge cast made out of cobblestone on a IC, and I was just impressed by it. I spent so much time, so much resource in just building this. They, that was amazing to me. So what did I try to do? <laughs> I think I just goofed around. <laughs> he said goofed around. Oh, oh. I just, I don't even, I, I, yeah, let me be honest, I don't remember that much what I did back in the day. I think all I did was mine, or just walk around the castle and admire it. I don't even think one of them was bothered by it, I think they were honored. I, not honored, let's not say honored. I think, let's say they liked it, that I was looking at their work and saying it was cool. You know what kind of makes me sad about today's games? Of course, you can crash literally every game, but why are there so many games now which get bad crit bad feedback or just have microtransactions? I mean, look look at Anthem for example or Fallout 76. They are they always look promising and they just end up bad on. Anthem looks really good. I'm not gonna lie, but. I've read a lot about the loot box issue. I mean, just the loot system, not loot box, my bad. And it makes me sad. Of course, there's people working hard on Anthem behind the scenes, but I just end up feeling bad for them. So, of course, you may say you can't really feel bad for them. Oh. <laughs> because of them having patched a. <clears throat> A bad bug, which actually increased the drop chance by a lot more. Twice. Then there's Fallout 76, and you know what Fallout 76 is. It's just this huge mess of what I can assume Bethesda are trying to kill off their reputation as fast as possible. That's that's how, how that's how I see it. This leads me back to... I got goose. This leads me back to the starting topic. Why can I go back... Why can't I go back to when things were simpler? Why can't I go back to times where I had more fun than right now? As always, life is kinda hard. It's not a wish concert. You've just gotta... dig through it. I have this one dream. I don't think I'm even mean, gonna... Uh, I'm not even bothered or um, uncomfortable with sharing it. 
because I myself think it's a stupid and unreasonable dream. It, my dream is to maybe one day just open up this small cafe bar and just chill there all day, talk with customers, have music play in the background. It's just, of course, there's going to be a lot more stress than I'm currently mentioning of getting right now, but that's the thought of a own coffee bar with all of what I mentioned is really relaxing. I've always longed for relaxed stuff instead of super exciting stuff. Of course it may say, Hotline Miami isn't relaxing, why are you doing that? Because I'm trying out things. I enjoyed Hotline Miami. Of course, that's evident from the amount of stuff, videos I've uploaded about it. But still, I just like relaxing things more. Of course, I sometimes am super autistic and just go full hype mode, if you understand what I mean. It's basically, I just go full excited. I probably have some sort of autism. I don't know. I don't even care, to be honest. It keeps a childish part of me inside of me. I mean, oh, let me just rephrase it. I have, I have a part of me that's still childish and I don't, I'm not even bothered about that. I think having a childish part of yourself is always a nice idea to sometimes be silly or just sometimes not be serious, forget the real life for, forget the life for, forget everything around you for a moment and instead have a nice laugh or joke about something silly. It's quite a nice thought to be honest. But iron, that's quite nice. Uh, I should probably make a chest plate and then either a iron pickaxe or a iron sword. It's oh, it's getting. You know what? Even if I die, I don't care. I'm gonna watch this. It's quite beautiful. Don't lie. I wanna sprint over there shortly and just watch the hill. The old Minecraft was so flashy. It has it has so many neon cars in it. It was just. Uh, uh, it was just... hold on. Uh, no, not slabs, please. And... and the side. Alright. I think the Minecraft... Sunrise is still one of the most beautiful things in Minecraft. Can you? Okay, I shouldn't care. It's beautiful, really. Did you just say bro? Really? Yeah, there's all these. What? 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 Oh, sure, why not? I can let that play, I guess. Hold on, maybe... What's the volume on this? Oh, we're already 22 minutes over! Oh! Hey, guess what? Ha! Happy April Fool's Day! All I've said is probably a joke or not, who knows? Maybe... It yeah, I'm not, I'm not funny enough to do a, such an epic April Fool's joke like that. I could probably make the video a bit funnier, but uh... Haha, <laughs> April Fool's, I guess. F I guess have a nice April Fool's day. Ha! Ah. Bro! Goodbye. <laughs> Thank you. 
Bruh, 